and welcome to the HS Game Time Studios. I'm Pep Fernandez. This is EPJ Eric Paul Johnson. The high school football playoffs kick off this week, round one, and the Norta Vista Braves will be playing Silverado on Friday despite forfeiting seven of their victories because of an ineligible player. EPJ, it sounds like the River Valley League, which Novi plays in, got together, the administrators at least, and decided that this was the best route for them. Yeah, you know what what happened first is Norta Vista discovered one of the one of the players, the player in question here, had falsified an address when he had transferred into the school. So that discovery came, and then when Nordavista discovered that, they went to the administrators in the River Valley Le League to see what action needed to be taken. So um, they did have to forfeit seven games, including three league games, which means Nordavista will be stripped of the River Valley League title that now belongs to Moreno Valley. But because the vote, uh, or because all this happened so late into you know, the week, uh, day or two... Because it was discovered when, Wednesday? Yes, it was discovered either or, you know, Tuesday or Wednesday when everything kind of got processed that they found out about, you know, the ineligibility of this player, that the vote went to the River Valley League on Thursday on what to do in terms of playoffs. And um, what happened here was it came so late into the week, a day or two before games, that if they would have taken Norte Vista out of the playoffs, apply the forfeits, you would have seen Moreno Valley go as the number one team from the River Valley League, then La Sierra, then Patriot. So it would have knocked out Ramona as well as uh, Norte Vista. So they would have had to have sent those teams in, and CIF would have had to redo the entire bracket. It would have been a big mess this late in the game. Right? right. You know, you've had teams preparing three to four days for one team, and now you could have had, you know, oh, here's a new team for you to prepare for in less than 24 hours. So the River Valley League decided to stand by the three teams <coughs> um, with a vote that are in the playoffs. So Norte Vista will be allowed to continue through the Eastern Division playoffs as long as they win. Now, the only, um, you know, the only other question, you know, I've put some questions to CIF about this, whether or not um, the league could have voted to vacate Norte Vista. Just say, we don't submit a league champion, keep, Norte Vista, uh, keep uh, Marino Valley, keep Ramona in, and they said no, that was not possible. So that would have allowed just Silverado to have a victory in the first round in advance? And yeah, it would have been a walk. Essentially a buy. Yeah, a walkover for them. Yeah. But um, no, they said they have, the league has to submit three playoff teams. So they either had to reshuffle with the forfeits or keep the, the um, standings how they were. Um, the only way that Norte Vista could have been other way that they could have been eliminated or forfeit is on their own. They could have walked out. They could have stepped out of the playoffs themselves, giving Silverado the, you know, the walkover win. So this is not unprecedented in CIF history. Um, it's happened a couple other times. The most noted one was in 2006. The Long Beach Poly Girls basketball team had to forfeit over 20 victories in the regular season, including all their league victories. Um, it, they were two and 24, I believe. And the Moore League voted four to three, it was a close vote, to allow Long Beach Poly to go into the playoffs. Long Beach Poly ended up going on to advance the section title. They lost in that title game, but then they went on to win the state championship. So, you know, not unprecedented by CIF. CIF will stand by this decision. The power is with the league to submit which three teams go to the playoffs. All right, so you heard it here, the River Valley League allowing Norta Vista to continue their season into the playoffs despite the seven forfeited victories and uh, Moreno Valley, your 2013 River Valley League champion. All right, uh, keep it tuned to HS Game Time for the latest. We will have someone, I believe, at the uh, Norta Vista Dennis Pope will be there. Silverado <laughs> game on Friday night. I'll be there as well getting some uh, video highlights, so please check back with HS Game Time for uh, more on the Norta Vista Braves. For EPJ, I'm Pep Fernandez. We'll see you next time on HS Game Time.